I'm Gianluca Bisol. Uh, I'm uh, the president of uh, Bisol Winery. Our winery is uh, a long history winery in uh, the area of the Prosecco Superiore DOCG. Prosecco Superiore DOCG is uh, only in the best hills uh, of the Veneto region and is the really, really historic area of Prosecco. You know that after this uh, success of Prosecco, now the, there is also another Prosecco, more simple, that is the Prosecco DOC. But uh, remember, if you want to have uh, the best expression of the value of the, this kind of grape, the Glare grape, that is the grape that we use for the Prosecco Superiore, the best results are in the hills, in the highest and steepest hills that my family own from 21 generation, from 1542. And how many hectares do you own that are in the DOCG? We, we own, we manage 77 hectares in 21 different plots in the height hills of the area. And how many bottles of DOCG Prosecco do you produce each year? We produce uh, uh, of Bisol 400,000 bottles of uh, uh, Prosecco Superiore, that is uh, the Prosecco that is produced from single vineyard in the very highest and steepest hills of Albiadene. Now we are going in the most expensive vineyard of the world for sparkling wine. Cartizze is uh, very small, it's only 106 hectares. So in the very big area of, of a Prosecco that in total is uh, more than 30,000 hectares, Cartizze is only 106 hectares. So this means that every 600 bottles of Prosecco there is only one bottle of Cartizze. And how much of how much land in Cartizza have you? Uh, we have two hectares, yeah, historically from 1542, so it's a long uh, tradition of our vineyard. So, very simple is to remember that every six bottle of Prosecco DOC, there is only one bottle of Prosecco Superiore. And every 600 bottle of Prosecco in total, there is only one bottle of Cartizze. And the total extension of the area of Prosecco is around 32,000 hectares. That is the half extension, for example, of the Bordeaux area. It's big, but not like Bordeaux. It's a little bit smaller than Champagne. Champagne is 34, I think, uh, around 34,000 hectares. So, Prosecco in total is uh, 2,000 hectares less extension of the Champagne area. And Cartizze, for sure, I think is the most steepest vineyard for sparkling wine in the world. As you can see, it's like a wall, a wall of vineyard. So what, which wines have we got here? Well, now we, I'm opening hoping the bottle of Cartizze that is produced exactly in this vineyard.
for you and this is for me. Thank you. Salute. Cheers. So how many bottles of the Kartitsa do you... We produce uh, around 20,000 bottles of Kartitsa. It's a small production, but it's the, the, best, uh, the best quality of this kind of grape. Because this kind of soil, as you can see, this hill is the highest and the steepest hills. It's because these hills born in the ge geological area in a different period of uh, the other hills. And uh, it's very rich in terms of, uh, of uh, different kind of, of minerals that create uh, this uh, quality for the Katice. And the most practical example of this uh, influence is that we can leave this grape one month more than all the other hills in the vineyard without losing acidity. And this allows us to, 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 to receive the maximum, uh, the maximum uh, expression of the varietal, the, the original aromas flavor of the grape. Salute.